Dayton Hamvention 2024. I'm with Jim Carlson, Carlson Communications, Roof Towers. Now, Jim, your product solves a lot of problems for people that live in like an HOA restricted environment or maybe folks that don't have a big enough lot to put up a large antenna, uh, antenna tower. Can you kind of explain what Roof Towers is and how it came to be? Okay, well, the basic um, concept, I think, started about 20 years ago or so when people, you know, had a constraint with property and uh, location or, you know, something. And they, they started wor working with a company, Glenn Martin, back then. And as time went along, uh, that uh, it ended up, uh, uh, we took that business over about a, a six months ago. We redesigned the product a little bit to optimize it for, uh, let's say, weight, for cost, through performance. And uh, we ended up, you know, uh, now with it being in high demand. Well, explain some of the some of the typical setups. What kind of antenna um, uh, can you install on one of these roof towers? Well, um, on our website, we, we actually have uh, three pages of a breakdown of the different antennas, their uh, their their physical weight as well as their wind loading uh, levels, and it shows you know how many you can put, uh, adding on other things. Um, so that it it. it uh, It'll, it, we have a model that is rated for uh, 13 um, um, square feet of uh, antenna size, and we have a model that's 12, and then we have another model. And and you have to look at what your height, what kind of antenna you want, your height desired above the mass berry, and um, and that's when you can. That's how you sort of pick it out. And. We'd be remiss if we didn't mention your hinged roof base, right? Can you talk a bit about uh, what advantages and what uh, a good use of case for your uh, hinged roof base would be? Well, um, that's how we got started with this project about a year and a half ago, was because um, I had purchased um, one from Model A, and then uh, and, and but it wasn't it, it didn't feel like it was really strong enough for the tower, and then I looked around and noticed again there was a market lack and um, the market need. So um, we basically spent, spent the time to design one that was about twice as strong, or effectively your power would buckle before the base would fail. <laughs> well, there you have it. Uh, we're at Dayton Hamvention 2024 with Jim Carlson of RoofTowers.com. You can buy these products right now at DXEngineering.com, and certainly you can ask our tech service, and, and, and Jim here will be happy to answer any of your questions you may have. So long from Dayton Hamvention 2024.